My name is uh, Dominic Amanya. I'm a South Sudanese by nationality and uh, I lead a community based organization called Kakuma Social Adventures in Kakuma Refugee Camp. Uh, based on my own experiences, uh, grown up in a refugee camp, uh, basically I have different experiences in regards to climate change. Therefore, I would say that uh, climate change is real and uh, I've realized this uh, through some of our own personal experiences because uh, initially Kakuma's uh, Kakuma refugee camp is actually is an, uh, an arid area though with some uh, few rainfall uh, but currently we, we, we experience less rainfall and uh, basically when uh, rain comes it becomes too much like floods initially uh, I think some days ago or uh, if not months ago, uh, there was a very heavy rainfall that uh, came in Kakuma, which uh, displaced a lot of people. So many people had to migrate because of the seasonal rivers around Kakuma, because Kakuma refugee camp is within the zones of uh, uh, seasonal rivers. So when uh, uh, rainfall is too much, uh, the, 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 the floods actually displace people. So that is one of the impact of uh, climate change. Also, uh, we have realized this uh, in uh, numerous ways also because uh, as refugees, uh, they get some, uh, uh, they, they are distributed as some uh, food materials and uh, other materials uh, at the camp. So uh, with uh, these current climate issues, uh, the ratios have uh, reduced and uh, these have uh, enhanced uh, poverty and the hunger within the camp and the host communities. Therefore, I think uh, we need a collective effort, both the refugee, youth, children, the elderly, and the whole community uh, to come with actions towards climate change. One could plant a tree, one could come up with a kitchen garden, one could uh, come up with uh, innovative, uh, uh, smart agricultural practices which could enhance or uh, otherwise uh, uh, combat climate change.